my shoes on? Mommy, I want you to tea. Thank you. I like that tea. Right. Put your shoes on. Good job. Put your shoes on. Mm -hmm. Oh, from Trichin's Pace. You're welcome. Mm hmm Mm-hmm. Yeah, Grandma's coming. Do you love it? Yeah. <laughs> Good morning, guys. The sun is behind me, so I don't know if this footage is going to be too bright or not. But we, um, Bella, my oldest daughter, woke up a few days ago with a very like runny nose, congested, um, and I was like, "Oh no, here it goes." The very start of November. Um, you could tell she just wasn't feeling her best. She never got a fever, so she's still pretty congested now, but I can tell it's gotten a little bit better, but I was keeping an eye on her because TMI, she started having a little bit of bloody nose. Yeah, um, a little bit of a bloody nose. So I was watching out for like a sinus infection and if she needed medicine, that has calmed down now. So now I'm just keeping an eye on her, but now <laughs> the girls and I have it. Um, my son seems to be okay for the most part. I don't know if his immune system is stronger than ours um, or what, but for the past three times that the girls and I have gotten sick, he hasn't gotten it, which is which is good. I'm so happy about that, but it's, it is, I am curious to know, like, does that mean like his immune system is stronger than ours? Hey, baby. But the girls are sick. I'm sick. Um, my bosses are not letting me have off today. <laughs> AAK, the toddlers are my boss. So I made myself come home. Um, I did take some Tylenol. I think that has helped. My body feels just very achy and sluggish. I'm not as congested as the girls yet, but I don't know if this is the beginning of it. Um, but I took some Tylenol. I don't have a fever. The girls don't have a fever. Bella didn't have a fever this morning. So we went ahead, went to school. Um, but Layla all morning was just like, bleh, you know, yucky, green, just a blah, you know. Um, Emmy, yesterday I think was Emmy's bad day. Because yesterday she, you could tell in her face that she did not feel good. Today she seems to be a little bit better. But Layla has it more. Um... But the body aches are just really bad. Um, I'm feeling a little bit better today. You know, I made myself come home, stick to my routine. That way later on during nap time, I could try to rest with the girls and not be worried about, you know, things I need to get done. So I made myself come home, fix our breakfast, of course. And then I made myself go ahead and clean up the kitchen so that's just done and over with. And I'm so glad. I did that. I did not feel like doing it. Whoever feels like cleaning, sometimes I do, honestly. Sometimes I do find cleaning um, therapeutic. I don't know why, and decorating and stuff, but I made myself do it so that way yeah. it's done and over with. And so after breakfast, I got them dressed and it feels amazing outside. Um, it's like in the low 76s, but it's like a little warm, but there's like a little breeze blowing. So it's not like uh miserably hot and kids get sick so how do you feel are you a little stuffy look at mama you can tell in her face that she doesn't feel the best so and that didn't last long i had a feeling we weren't going to be out there that long but i tried but now the girls of course want a snack it's like 10 30. So they normally eat a snack around 10, 10 30 anyway. So they love these little prepackaged 
cheese. <laughs> they just love cheese. So I'll either get string cheese or I'll get these. I try to switch it up every now and then, but usually for some reason they ask for cheese for snacks. And then I have like these little cheese breadstick things. Not the healthiest, but it's fine. So cheese. Cheese, I like cheese. No, one's for Layla. Well, yeah, I mean, you wanna give it to Layla? Yeah. Thank I you. Like I guess y'all are done eating your Layla's has gushers and cheese. <laughs> that couch is so gross. I want to get new couches so bad, but I'm trying to wait till we move. And I tried to, I rented a thing. I cleaned these carpets after they had gotten a bad virus and thrown up everywhere. So I had cleaned these carpets really, really good. And I tried to use a handheld thing to clean the couches. That one over there isn't as bad because they don't really sit on that couch, but this one has been through it. And we've had these couches for a good four years now. Um, but the thing, it just made it turn really dark. It didn't clean it. I don't know if it just wasn't working properly, but it looks pretty bad. It's clean but it just doesn't look that way but i scrubbed it so hard with that handheld thing and it still just kind of sadly stayed the same but do you need to wipe your hands no you need blow okay okay something easy tonight but um our weather's really getting a little bit chilly at nighttime so tomorrow i'm gonna cook a roast and potatoes carrots and all that all day in the crock pot so i was just doing something simple today but i have a big old roast um to cook Maybe tomorrow coffee. so that'll be really good especially because it's like chilly outside you know so he brought the mattress in that my mom got but the kids are now sitting down to eat it's about 6 30 normally we eat between 6 6 30 sometimes a little bit earlier um but i was working on something before i could start cooking so our remote also stopped working i don't know if i said that or not but brad ran up to lowe's to get one because i tried to instacart one and it kept saying they didn't have it so i don't know why the one he got was cheaper than one i got so i don't know why they just didn't substitute it or whatever but anyways he got it it's working now it's actually better than the one we had because this one you can just push a button and it'll take you to youtube or push the button and it'll program the TV instead of having to push a button, but a bunch of buttons in on um, set it up or whatever. But good morning, guys. <laughs> it's the next day. Wow. The girls are playing. <laughs> I just got their breakfast down. Um, last night we ate dinner, got their pajamas on, and then we all laid down because we're all kind of feeling whatever this is. I don't know. I'm not as congested as the girls are, but. I could definitely feel it and then my son started my son started feeling a little sick the girls seem to be doing much better um bella's still asleep um today's the election day so school is closed today which i didn't even realize because i need to swap out i have a huge calendar on the wall there and like all their stuff set up that's kind of how like i keep up with everything <laughs> having four kids and myself and everything that's going on sports stuff and just everything so i literally write everything down but i have not done November's board yet. I'm gonna do that today. Um, but so you wanna come eat babies? So the big kids are um still sleeping. They'll probably be up soon, but Emmy got up at six thirty this morning. So anyways, we're still kinda of feeling yucky. I'm hoping Yeah. Um they're still kinda snotty themselves as well. But anyways, I just wanted to end the video. Um thank you guys so much for watching. And supporting Daddy. yes baby Daddy woke me up. oh daddy woke you up thank you so much for watching and to our new subscribers thank you so much and if you haven't already and she just poked my eye <laughs> that deserves a subscribe if you haven't already please join our family and subscribe it means so much to you to our family I cannot thank you I'm tired <laughs> I cannot thank you enough we appreciate you so much um this has been a journey. There was many times when I was like, do I stop? But I love vlogging. And then you guys have been supporting our family for 
quite a few months now, so I just want to say thank you. Um, it really, truly means a lot. It does not go unnoticed. Like, every day, your comments and watching my videos and supporting our family, it means a lot, you know. I'm just hoping that, honestly, to be able to, like, buy some groceries because groceries are literally ridiculous right now. It's like a house payment for us each month, so... Just being able to buy some groceries because I'm a stay-at-home mom to four. If you're new here, 11, 7, 4, and 3 now. Um, yeah, 4 and 3. They just both had birthdays. It's crazy. Um, and he's a crane operator, but I'm a stay-at-home mom. So, you know what? If I'm able to help out and like, oh, I got the phone bill. I got the light bill. I can buy the groceries. Like, that would be absolutely amazing and such a big blessing to be able to do so i just want to say thank you guys so much and i probably will say that on every video but you're the reason i'm here you're the reason i keep posting um so i will thank you every video but if you haven't already please subscribe turn your bell notification on leave comments down below if you don't mind giving us a little like it just helps our channel because it is a smaller channel so when you like it and leave comments it, youtube does push the video out a little bit so but anyways, thank you guys so much. We hope you're not going through whatever this is. I know there's a lot of stuff going around right now, but hopefully the next few days and hopefully by this weekend, maybe it'll be out of our house. Bye guys. We'll see you on the next video. You want to say bye? Okay, come say bye. There you go. What do you say? <laughs>